I love it down here, it's great. Credit to all the staff that have made this a brilliant project. Hello, my, name, my name's Adam and I work at the Mudlarks Allotments where we use the food for the vegetarian cafe. So I basically come down here and uh, for two days, I, I mean I'm on a college course at the moment but this is work experience for me at the moment. And uh, I love it down here, it's great, the people are fantastic and there's just like a great team spirit. I mean, we all grow our own produce and our own, our, our own fresh fruit and vegetables, and it's it, it's it's a nice atmosphere. We all get on well with each other. I don't think there's anyone down here that's not friends. It's that sort of vibe, and it's it, it's 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 a place where you come down here, and it's it's infectious. You feel like you want to come back for more and that's what you want. you want. You want happy environments where people are enjoying what they're doing and yeah, they're, they're succeeding in a brilliant environment here so cre credit, to, um, cre credit to Vic and all the, all the staff that have made this a brilliant project. Mike, we might have to call you the buzzsaw. Look at that. I come to Mudlarks on a Wednesday and I do um, gardening, weeding, watering, you, 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 you name it, I do, I, do, I do it all and I enjoy it. My name's Karen, I like Mudlarks and I've got all my friends here and I've been here a long time as well and I'm an Arsenal fan. Mudlarks has helped me. I mean, I've gained much more independence since joining Mudlarks. I've been able to make my own decisions and as I've got more experienced, I've been able to grow what I want to grow and I've learned a lot about I've learned a lot about nature and about plants, but more importantly about social skills working together. No, <laughs> no I, th I think they come because of obviously the, the amazing place that, that we've got here and everything that you know the guys can do and experience while they're here is you know it's, it's not always available everywhere else. You know it's um, it's sad but it's true. It's you know it's something that we offer that not many people do. Building better opportunities allows the guys to, to be able to integrate into society and you know, earn their own money. You know they make their own money, so it's you know they can pay their own way and get their lunch, and you know it's a really important part of life for them.
Leaving Prison Behind project is all about getting um, offenders sort of work ready as such, um, getting training, education. Basically the clients will come in for the day, we make up garden furniture, um, which the charity garden centre then sells on. They keep the profit, the cost of the wood goes back into more, making more. Um, part of the, the projects is to get people into employment. Um, so I think off the top of my head, I think there's like seven people from the projects has got into employment uh, on six month contracts, full time employment. Um, we run a horticultural course, um, which nine of the clients walked away with a certificate or award. Um, so yeah, and I think it's all about the, the clients and learning new skills. Um, I think it's a it's a great space as well, great workshop, um, working with Tony and um, Accra. I think it's a brilliant um, project as well. It helps people change their, their lives really. I know my um, partner is in the same situation as a lot of the people that come here and um, he was working in the workshop and from here it's helped us start our own business. Over the past three or so years, HAPRA has been working very, very closely with the Hertfordshire Constabulary on a programme to rehabilitate prolific offenders. And HAPRA assists them in that process. The impact of our work is immense. It helps to keep the majority of offenders clear of crime, which means there are less burglaries in Hertfordshire, fewer victims of crimes in Hertfordshire, and that's got to be for the right reasons. Now, we are incredibly delighted to be working um, on and be part of the Building Better Opportunities Initiative. For us, it's a real opportunity to continue our work in partnership and build even closer links with our partners. But it's exciting because it also enables us to work with other organisations that we currently don't work with and we're looking forward to doing that. It's a really exciting initiative as far as we're concerned, bringing together all the relevant agencies for a much more common purpose. We are very much welcoming the opportunities that this initiative will bring and look forward to cultivating more cohesive working with all our partners. Since I started the groundwork course, I've realised what I want to do in life and it's given me the confidence to take the next step. Uh, basically what we've got here, we've got ground team work today and what we're going to be doing today is going to be lifting some logs. Um, basically what we're going to be doing is building a flower bed and a raised flower bed. So collecting the logs, putting them in a separate pile, finding the logs that are best suitable for the job. Groundwork Park for Shear. Uh, are excited to be working alongside uh, the Strive project, also building better opportunities to target uh, adults around the Hertfordshire area to improve their job prospects, their self-esteem and altogether their work ethic. Uh, a lot of the young people that we work with um, come from difficult backgrounds, uh, have a lot of barriers when it comes to finding employment or finding uh, a direction once they leave school, once they leave college. Hello, my name's Claire. I'm from Celtic Harmony, one of the two directors who co-founded the organisation in 1998. We co-founded it to give school children an opportunity to experience life in ancient Britain to increase their understanding of the natural world. 
and we've now expanded over the last 18 years. Um, we have over 11,000 visitors and we have our work experience and volunteering programme. Hi, I'm Luca from Celtic Harmony and today we've got some friendly volunteers that come and help us every Monday from uh, We Do Care. I like being out in the fresh air, um, being busy and organising myself. I decided to do this course be because I wanted to take the opportunity to um, come, out, come out here with the group. I've achieved um, GCSE exams. The STRIFE programme has enabled 20 partners in Hertfordshire to come together and work to make a difference and to help people in Hertfordshire develop their skills and self-confidence to build a better future.